If you're concerned about your water well pump cycling on and off too frequently, this video is for you. So this is a booster pump system. So what we have here is the main coming in here with this valve. Now the water well on the other end of this is about 2,000 feet away. Now my daughter and her family had had pressure. They didn't have good rate. So we decided to put a booster system in. So the way it works is water comes from the main well up through here, through this valve all the way up to that tank. And in the tank, there's a flow. So it keeps this tank, it's a 350 gallon tank. Well, it, it keeps it full about right there. So it's got a great hysteresis with this valve. I'll have to show it to you. The water turns off here and the pump can pull it down to about right here. This float, the water from right here, starts filling that tank again. Now the way the pump works is water comes in through this valve. This is the suction side. This is a drain. Comes in here. This has a uh, cut on, cut off switch. It cuts on around 30, cuts off around 60. Comes up, the discharge is through this pipe here. You know, so I got union so I can take this this assembly out of here, this pump. Comes up here. You can see this through this pipe. Alright, and back down through here and it goes to the house. This right here goes up to the expansion tank. The expansion tank, you put, uh, we're gonna, it's set at 28 pounds of pressure. There's a bladder right at the top, put 28 pounds in it, holds 28 pounds on their system. Now, in the event that we have problems, if their tank is full, they could run, uh, let's say it's 250 gallons, they could run for 250 gallons before needing more water. Uh, they could call a potted water company, they could deliver water and they could fill this tank up. Or the other side of that is if, if this pump fails, then they close this valve and they close this valve. This one uh, being the tank fill and this one is uh, supply back to the house. Close those two, open this bypass and they're back to where we were before we installed the pump. So they ran since last July on a bypass. So that's how it works. 